first YouTube video yesterday. Behind the video, I had sound playing in the background, and then I talked on top of the sound to give a narration, but I wasn't happy with the volume of the sound. Fortunately, I had ordered the Lark Max All-in-One Wireless Lavalier Microphone System, and I'm going to open up the box and let you guys see what's in it. So this is the paperwork. And then inside is this really sharp looking box to keep it in. So up here is storage for some other things. And this is the charging box that it comes in. So when you open up this box, you have this lavalier mic, that is the transmitter, and this lavalier mic, and then this is the receiver. And this has a cold shoe that you can put on top of your video camera or your tripod, whatever you're using. And you can see in here, maybe, there are the charging ports inside. So what you do is you connect your USB cable right there, put all of your components inside this box and it charges it. And you can charge it even when you're on the road. So a little bit more about what's in here. This is, oh, this is the little fuzzy thing that goes over the mic so that you don't have the wind noise. So you would put this on top. The one thing that I heard about this is that it can fall off. So it's a rubber grip, but you gotta be careful you don't lose it because if you lose it, then that's a problem. Anyway, you press that out to be able to clip it on your lapel. And this is the second one of those. And this is the cable in case you need this kind of connection to connect to your phone or whatever device you're using to record on. A couple more things. This appears, this is just another cable to connect. This has the 90 degree angle on the one end, which is convenient. And this is a USB-A to USB-C. So this is a USB-C to a lightning cable. Now for setting it up. So the instructions are in this packet. When you open this up, you get contact information for them. You get a packing list so you can make sure everything is in there. And you get the quick guide. When you open up the quick guide, there is a QR code. You scan that with your camera. Which brings you up to this screen where you can download the manuals in different languages. There's a leaflet you can download. I was more concerned about the firmware. I wanted to make sure I had the most updated firmware, which was updated 630 of 2023. So it's probably already included in what I purchased, but just in case, we're gonna go ahead and download that. The quick start manual says the best position for the transmitter is to be on your collar, closer to your face, and then it tells you how to connect the receiver to an iPhone or connect it to the Android with through the USB-C interface. When you take all the stickers off and put the components back into the box, you can see on the receiver the battery level of all of the items. So this is the mic. It's down to like 96% because I've been playing with it. This is the receiver at 99% and the other mic I haven't messed with is 100%. So I assume they all came 
at 100% charge, but you can see the dots at the top showing that it's charging. It also says at the top that the case is 100%. And you can see the dots on the case that it is charged up. When you have your microphone connected, the receiver has several different display options. So this is the display that is showing the output. I've got the, the, the transmitter connected to my sweatshirt right now. And you press this over here and it goes to the different screen. So right there it's showing mic two, which I'm not using right now. You turn the dial on the left to switch to mic one, and then you can press this button again and show the output or go um, cycle through the different options. So I'm going to set this down and I'm going to walk away from my phone, which the receiver is plugged into, so that you can get a good idea of what the sound or sounds like coming from further distance away. So right now I'm at about 10 feet. And I'm going to walk a little bit further, and now I'm at, I'm at 20 feet, and I'm around a corner now, and I would say I'm probably about 30 feet, and now I'm going to walk upstairs, and I'm probably about 40 feet away now. So that kind of gives you a good idea of how it sounds when you're walking away from the mic. So this gives you lots of options of where you can set your recording equipment and where you, how far you can be away from it. This concludes the basic unboxing of the Hollyland Lark Max.